Alright, kembali lagi BTW di Nobrian Sawardo aka Nobrian CK YouTube channel. Kali ini kita akan menonton untuk Game of Future Mobile Legend untuk finalnya ya. Tarungan antara Onyx dan juga AP Brand ini adalah game keempat. Jadi Onyx sebelumnya menang dan apakah Onyx di sini bisa memperpanjang asa? atau akan kalah oleh AP Brand itu. Let's see. Untuk tim di sini menarik ya. Untuk Onyx di situ ada Tablapu, One One, Lilia, Matilda dan juga Barat. Sedangkan untuk AP Brand di situ ada Nana, ada Gwyn, Nifer, Cici, Rupi dan juga Patrick ya. Usul nggak ada tanker tanki ya? Nggak ada cuy, bahaya banget sih Iya nggak ada tanki-tanki jungle ya Katanya Katanya Romer Ruby yang mana Bisa dibilang tidak terlalu tanky juga sebenarnya I feel like also Kyrie is gonna have to manage those stacks. So mid lane siapa sih? Nah, nah lah. Be a little bit of a problem, but maybe a little bit of an engage. Keep boy able to get the knock up onto Ogwen. Ooh. Trying to get out, but not able to. Flat Tizi getting the final hit. First blood for the side of AP Bren. Kyrie decides that's it. We're coming. Wah, bisa kalah ini Onik. Kita lihat ya. Yeah, but Ogwen doesn't want to let up. Flat Tizi, they're all over him. Gonna force him to use the retry here. He's gonna be okay, but at least they force that out. AP Bren with that, and Kyle Tizi not using the retry. They're gonna try to go for a purple buff steal here. Ooh. I mean, they can, right? I mean, they have the retry. This would be clutch for him. Kyrie gets welcome. to Daytona's welcome, though. And the stun. Ooh, Kyle Tizi. A lot of damage. Able to get away. Grand theft purple. Oh, but purple, ternyata. Winifer ternyata bisa pulang gitu. And they're just applying heavy, heavy pressure. Right now, we're not seeing too many rotations. I mean, it's four minutes in with only one kill. We can kind of take a look at some of the items. We see Corrosive Scythe being picked up by Albert, which is clutch. Right now, I nice. think... Uh, ooh, ooh. Flap a bit of damage on the flap, but flap still. I mean, that's just a CC right there, man. It's like, even when you think you got the better, out of nowhere, she's throwing more yo-yos in your face. <laughs> Oh, Wan Wan agak darah darah di sini. Wan Wan though struggling a little bit down here against Super Marco. Two major happening still. It's one and zero gold at a small deficit for AP Bren, but this is definitely a good spot for them if Super Marco can keep dominating in this top lane and Albert having to stay with this. Like I said, it's going to be a problem. They need Albert to scale. They need Albert to be able to get some free waves here and be able to get involved in these team fights soon. Oh, a lot of damage on the keyboard. Oh, boy, might just be able to get away from this. Oh, no. Taken down and a kill goes into the pocket of Super Marco. Matilda. I wonder if Super Marco picked up the Blade of Despair. Because he's doing a lot of damage at this point, right? And now the turtle is probably going to be uncontested because you can already see the side of the map. Bravest fighter on the flat, but I don't think it's going to be too much of a problem. 
Onik, I like this. They're responding. They know they can't get the turtle, and this is what I was saying before. Can they take something here? Oh, no, Sans Mati. Take something themselves. Find Sans. <laughs> That's bad. Duitnya kalah telak ini. Yeah, I mean, you can already see they're gonna, uh, you know, Wario this this tower right here. Oh no, they backed off. They seen the the numbers difference was there. Again, I think the side of Onik, they just gotta keep this up. Like you were saying, Albert needs to kind of get fed. Oke, buat Len Nancur. And uh, Sons, I mean, I'm gonna have to stop dying here. They're, they're definitely taking advantage of it. The Matilda not coming into too big of a play yet. Yeah, definitely being monsters. Kyrie still trying to zone, but he's kind of been he's kind of been on his lonesome lately, and that's because Kyrie. I mean, that's because Keyboy has been forced to kind of babysit other areas, move around the map, stay close. Albert. Luckily, Albert hasn't taken a death yet. That's very important. Nice. You though on this Kyrie game, ambil lane. It's definitely gonna end up being a problem as well. It's gonna be hard for Kyrie. He's gonna have to watch out for those Molinas because that be game changer in a big retribution battle. True, true. Maki plus Nana memang very strong with it. Just reliving game one, like they are just applying so much pressure on Onik, and they have to find some type of relief here. But again, I feel like at some point they're keeping boom, boom, boom. They're keeping this left tower, which is Anjay bisa diserang terus anjir. To get a key play on this one one, and it can make differences. Petri serem juga anjir. Yeah, Onyx looks for the play play. Non -stop, but AP up at Onyx right now. Kyrie unable to get his last orange buff. They're losing towers in the bot. Here comes another turtle, last turtle of the game. Keyboy gonna try to make the roundabout, not able to get a knock on anybody. Ah, ra, ra, ra. He's able to take a Kyrie, taking huge damage, mm. unable to even finish the Detona's welcome. The rest of his team not there to help out. He went from a big dino to a tiny dino right there. It was big dino AP to a dead Brin. dino. Yeah, AP Brin just controlling the field turned him into a fossil uh, on it gonna have to figure out a way to bite back and i think i mean th they're controlling it here i just think at some point we need to see albert into an engage but they don't want to lose him oh, that's that he was going for the for the quick no scope right there almost hit super marco definitely becoming a threat two zero and one the 360 no scope <laughs> trying to land down Onik sekarang kurang kurang ya. Now, if I was on the side of Onik right now, I would just they they gotta play a tactical at this point, right? Like Albert's still doing really good. Keyboy hasn't died, but I think he needs to be in a little bit more of a key location to be able to save his team. Sometimes, mainly Sans at this point kind of die and taking a look at some of the items. We do see the the Demon Hunter sword being picked up by. Albert so okay one one coming online but the big is that Super Marco has the malefic roar secured and the blade of despair so the damage is a lot oh boots gets pulled back though with the arm offended there's no way to get the stone oh come back using the guiding wind oh let's see Lord Bisa ini everything they can on it do they want to try to push this over Lord Visa ini Oncil 
Kyrie taking a lot of damage here. Ogwin gonna get locked up, misses the I'm offended. Boots misses the stun. Super Marco. Hey, but that's Kyrie. nice. Able to take the first lord of the game there. They lose Sans in Boots though. Very similar to the last game. They're able to control the objective, but AP Bren may be able to crack, crack through this tower. Yeah, I mean, this is good pressure by AP Bren, but Onik able to secure it. I feel like it's good. Look at Albert. Possibly gonna be able to make a play. Maybe on the flap. Do they attempt it? They have Keyboy with them. Ah. No, they're just gonna play a safe back off. They got the Lord. They stall out a little bit more, but how long can they continue to play the stall game? Damn, bad thing. AP Bom, yeah, what? with a dominating lead what right now. Yeah, and we can already see Super Marco is just coming online. The damage is devastating. When the SMGs collide into any of the team fights, it's just Ah, it's too much really right now if I'm on the side of Onik they're, they're doing what I would do right just keep Albert farming keep him going he's one zero and zero really haven't seen any crossbow tanks coming out just yet but when they do that's probably gonna devastate AP Bren so I feel like that's the biggest thing we have to watch Ooh, out for I, we don't see a win of nature tapi bisa sih karena secara hero yang tanky itu kurang ya untuk si ap ya Albert playing the off lanes, doing it well, just farming up, still hasn't taken a death. So yes, you're right, that's huge. Um, but AP Bren, man, this is this is exactly where they want to be. And at this point, they feel comfortable. They're just going to kind of freeze up the lanes a little bit, slow play things, yeah. hold their gold lead, and wait for Onik to step out a little bit too much. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, he oh, missed both he... shots. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like if you had the SMG right there, Sans would have been panicking, yeah, but... I mean, Sans panicked anyways. He's like, Black Shoes, Black Shoes! <laughs> was not messing around. I mean, I think it was smart Sniper if he stayed shots. there. It could have been bad, but either way, like, yeah. you see the snipe come out, you're like, oh, I gotta go. Because you don't know who else is in the bush. Kyrie. A little bit of a skirmish here at the purple buff. Kyle Teasy. Looking for an angle as well. Super Marco gonna back off as few stays Ooh, pew, pew. Damage, pew. Flicker there. Takes that a like the passive does not proc. AP Bren still in control. Yeah, I mean I think they're they're in a little bit of control, right? I mean, right now Onik able to, you know, control a little bit of the right lane and the turtle area. I feel like this is gonna be a key play. Do they go opt for a concealed play? Kind of how do they approach this here? Utilities available for both sides. Lord in hand. That, uh, Nana does not have that flicker, so could be huge. You can kind of see Few staying into the back line, trying to keep them at bay. Onik, what's your play? Jepung, 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 gitu ya. I don't know. I mean, they, they do have control of the pit, but last time I felt like they had a little bit of control over the pit as well. They don't want to step too far out. They, they can't really take full control because if Boots gets to the other side of the river, he just gets torn apart. If Keyboy steps to the other side of the river, he just gets torn apart. So they kind of have to play this half and half game. Oh. So in trouble goes down a mega kill into the hands of Super Marco. Onik aborts oh, mission. They're going to back <laughs> off. They're going to give this lord over. It's 25 seconds till Sans is back up, and AP Bren isn't going to wait that long. Uh, I mean, it looks like they, they pulled back a little bit to maybe attack again. Lord Low. Oh, the Molina Blitz oh does land on to Kyrie. Nice. Marco able to secure the Lord. Kaltizi does use a retribution as well for it. Onik unable to make a move. Keyboy utilized the Purify to, to stay out of the I'm offended. It could have been really bad for Onik at that engage. Again, taking a look at some of the items, we still don't see a Wind of Nature being picked up by Super Marco, but the damage is there. There it is. Wind of Nature secured. This could be a tough go here, as we have not seen Albert use one crossbow of Tang. He used one, but it didn't do anything. Oh, Boom. One, <laughs> but it did not do anything. Oh, nice. I'm offended on a Kyrie. He's getting knocked up by the violent Requiem, and he's taken. Damn. Kyrie's still on the map, though. Able to just survive. 
No members from either team have dropped yet, but the inhibitor has fallen. Albert trying to get the swift plays, move around. Oh Does get the cross with Tang Mark, but he's not able to transform to the Molina. So that's what I get out Kyrie going to get the team. Masi. Willow. Him against the wall. Flap Tizi takes a little bit of damage, but the unoffended locks on to Kyrie. Kyrie. Kyrie, Masi. Can he survive this? A little bit of play. Stay alive. Tizi dashes back onto the team. Belum ada yang mati, anjir. Keras. They were looking for, but still nobody drops. And it's just insane to think about two teams like this can have a battle that long and nobody dies. That was crazy. Lords barreling down. Sustainability from both teams. Apa ada tank itu? Tapi secara will rata-rata tank semua sih. And to be honest, I was suspecting Super Super Marco to be dealing some like critical damage, but Onyx just able to eat it. Ah. Gonna lose another purple. He sees no buffs this game. Kyle T is always there, the man of Kyrie's nightmares right now. <laughs> Just retry after retry after retry. <laughs> Kyrie even has to, he even tried using the retry, but he's still unable to get it. Kyle Teasy and the team showing pure dominance. Yeah, I mean, there right now, AP Brins. Yeah, this is what I was saying, right? Like in the early stage, if if Kyrie's not able to keep up these stacks, it's gonna uh -oh. be uh -oh. a big problem. Oh, no! Ooh. Oh, Marco! Oh. Albert, why? Oh, no. Marco's Ooh. Shotgun loaded. Bow, bow, boom. Albert's gone, and now AP Bren smells the blood. Here comes the Bren effect. Flap Teasy gonna flap on in. Ogwin looking for something as well. Kyrie just trying to defend with the rest of the team, but boom! Damn. Marco takes out another. The target is locked. Oh, no. Taken down. Sans and Albert. Are off the map. The two major damage dealers is AP Bren gonna try to finish this out here. One oh, to, and to finish things off. Kyrie taking way too much mm -hmm. damage. Key boy looking for the knockup. Boots into the backside oh. with the bravest fighter. They're just trying to fend, but the minions keep on coming. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, uh, AP Bren uh, undisputed from world champions to the games of the future. Masih kalah dengan AP Bren ga? champion and you can see how happy they are they're standing on chairs look at i really look ah. through the crowd it's probably going wild at this point man i love it i love it and one of the things i love most I mean, it's okay AP Bren is their reactions every single time <laughs> these guys are the best in the world right now they're the best anywhere they go anything they touch they are dominating in damn it we saw a full best of seven this time last time but this time in the rematch ap bren makes quick work of onic i mean very well done fans around the world i'm sure it paid off if you've been watching uh. i mean the fans are kind of looking quiet from our side from what i've seen but hey Looks like it was a good game. I love, I love the sportsmanship right here, right? Like, look at this. Like, that, that is like oh. happiness on a whole nother level. Happiness on a whole nother level. And it looks like we're gonna be, are they gonna be raising the trophy? I think we're gonna have a trophy raise here. Both teams stepping up to the podium. I'm excited to see it. Yeah. I wonder who's gonna who's gonna get to raise it. Are they all gonna do it at once? Let's see. I never really got a good look at the trophy, but I can only I've seen it in like the videos. And they, they're not even worried about the trophy. Like the excitement on yeah. these guys are just overpowering all of their physical. <laughs> they're just I mean, well, they're just too happy. I understand it though. And that's the thing, right? It's 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 not just about it's not just about the money. It's not just about the trophy. It's it's about the win. And and right now these guys are feeling themselves, man. It's two huge championships back to back. AP <laughs> Bren has done it over and over again, and they feel great about it. Look at them. I mean, that's another notch in the belt there. Another huge win for AP Bren and for the Philippines themselves. These guys are the best in the world, and it's just undoubted.
AP Brand able to set off the year of 2024 with a blast. And just man, you could just think I, I love I'm like cheesing over here just because like you could just see how excited they are and it's just it's lovely to see that a team that's worked so hard and has this type of dedication just goes crazy. Man. I'm wondering if there's gonna be an interview. Um, I'm wondering if we're gonna get to hear anything from them. I would love to personally. It does look like there's gonna be a stage. I, I want to say that you can watch the actual interview. It's probably going to happen on the uh, on the Russian channel, most likely. Um, so if you guys want to catch that, feel free to jump on over. I think it's Games of Future official. Damn it. Sure the, the full interview will be there. We're working on a clean feed right now. So we're kind of missing out on some of this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm wondering what that blue thing is that was handed off is that like another trophy maybe an mvp that we just couldn't hear i'm maybe guessing it went to is that super marco that's the only thing let's see really i like oh god okay. that's gonna be it for us though it was an amazing experience yeah. Tadi itu sih pikirannya uh, kita nggak usah lihat itu karena ya ngapain anjir <laughs> Oh I helek Kita lihat helek They just controlled it just like the very first and second game. You can see that even though they lost a lord, they still took two down on the side of Onik, and that was one of the turning points. And then also Super Marco right here being able to take down. Mati sendiri di sana. Just it, it pushed them back. Like you said, they had to hit the abort button. They were like, oh god, we're not going to be able to contest this lord. They did attempt, but it wasn't enough. 15 minute mark. Kyle TZ diving back, kind of baiting out a lot of the utility. Again, AP Bryn at every corner. It looked like they were low. It, the fight just kept going. They kept poking and peeling and trying to take anything on it. And the side of AP Bryn. Any end, yeah. Got a teammaker, Joe. I love to see it. Just the. I'm, on it, did. They put up such a great fight. But the last game, AP Bryn. Coming in hot, coming in ready, and they took it all. One final reaction. You, you can, I can never get enough of the flat piece reaction to winning games. Game no. <laughs> <laughs> he almost falls. He knows, man. They know. And, and like, and here's Look the thing. They, and the, that's the Bren effect right there, baby. That's the Bren <laughs> effect. And it's like, it's the perfect blend of discipline and extreme confidence. And I think that's why. AP Brenna's so much of us because not only are they an amazing so, team, they have discipline, <laughs> team, team, but also they have no problem getting a little wild. And that's like the big difference that separates them between several others. Yeah, I mean, I feel like at some point when you're this far in and you, you've had such a clean match, like that's what you deserve. Like it, you've done put in all of this work, you put in all of this dedication, like let it go. Tapi ya, itu suatu itu memang strong sih. Like we might MVP. Patrick ya. Yeah, that that sh well, I mean, the game changing play, the shotgun at the end, waiting yeah. for Albert. He was about Burst. to recall. So Super Marco oh, was, was two seconds away from recalling. Yeah. Albert comes bouncing on up and just taken wow, out. Wow. That was it. Uh, just two two shotgun shells to the face, and it's over. That's all it takes. I think sometimes. Albert blinked, and then he was like, "I'm dead." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what we face checked the bush. You know, that's but the, the same, whole time. The same thing that happened in M5. One yeah. bad bush check. One bad yep. bush check changes everything, man. Damn it. Oh, that's that. Yeah, statistic, yeah. That hurt. Oh, Take a look at some of the hey. stats. Few as well. One zero and six. Super Marco seven zero and three. Uh, in the end, Onik only got one kill that game. Okay, so this is the end of offering. Final, selamat untuk AP Brand, sayang sekali. Tapi itu soal itu.
it, it was still pretty low. low. Yeah. Tapi it is what it is. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and see you to the next one.